Hello, I am excited to introduce to you the Missouri 4th District Undo List. This is a project that we started several months ago because I wanted to hear your voices and to be able to pass them on to the people here in Washington of what we believe needs to be undone. As you know, over the past several years, this government has inflicted far too many rules and regulations uh, on to the American people that has jeopardized their freedom it's, and it's hurting our economy. So I ask you to send me your ideas on what we need to do to undo the list. And we have compiled that into this document here that I was pleased to present to President Trump last week. You know, I hope that this will become a roadmap that he will use to help roll back a lot of these onerous regulations. But I wanted to share just a few of the voices that I heard and that are in this document. And you can access this document on our website. But several of you wanted to undo Obamacare. I heard from Mike in Cleveland, Missouri, who said, "My, I'm retired. My premiums have doubled in the last two years with Obamacare. Two years ago, I paid $305 per month. Last year, it increased to $422 per month. It is supposed to increase to $576 a month. Soon, I and my family will not be able to afford to see a doctor because we're putting our money towards premiums. Heard from an insurance agent who said, as an insurance agent, I see firsthand how unaffordable the Affordable Care Act, Obamacare, is and would like to see it undone. Others wrote in about Obama's uh, clean power plan. Uh, Bob from Columbia said, EPA's air quality standards are unreasonable and unwarranted during a time in this country when we need to buy down our national debt, put taxpayers back to work, and ensure self-sufficiency in energy. Um, someone else from Columbia wrote in about the overtime rule. It says, what the overtime rule has meant to me is the loss of my salary position to once again be returned to an hourly position with all the insecurity that an hourly position warrants. And he goes on and shares more concerns. And an issue that I'm involved in as a former teacher and hope to undo as part of legislation, but several of you wrote in about the school lunch program. And Bill from Lincoln, Missouri said, let the states and local districts control their own curriculum, operations, lunches, policies, and destiny. You know, there are many other uh, suggestions here from you. Uh, and you can go to my website and see what you said regarding eliminating windfall eliminations, uh, electronic logs and speed limiters, Dodd-Frank taxation, on and on. This is great. Thank you for participating in this project. Know that your voice is heard both by me, by people in Congress, and by President Trump. And we look forward to checking off this list and getting things undone.